Un ejército poco Papi, fuera, Alberto. hay problema, Tom. Papi, un gran problema. Alberto, my son, what happened? The Haitians. I hate these Haitians. They messed with me for the last time. These, these Haitians. We'll take them out. Only we need some backup. I lost a few hermanos already out there. Amigo, you drive good. For a woman, right? This is no time for joking. Come on, drive for me again. Take my boys over there, and then we'll take these Haitians down. When they mess with me, they mess with the biggest boy in town. That, right after this. <laughs> We're gonna fight like men! You can buy it anywhere, grocery store shop. Make sure that you're in a chair, cause your hands go up. Oh no! We Giggle cream! It makes dessert funny. He was a man of peace, living on a quiet farm in North Dakota. Till one day, all hell broke loose. Tim, we need you. I'm a man of peace. I'm done killing. I want... Hey, amigo. Good to see you can make it. This stinking nest of Haitians, we're gonna kill them all. Charge! Hands, man. Sniper on the roof! They fight like girls! Take cover! We need reinforcements from the cafe! Take out that cowardly sniper! This is the real deal. Fight like men with huge cojones! We have proved our mental bravery. Let us steal the van full of drugs and make a good escape. This is the van 19 west, Peter IT. Respond to a 10, 21 west, Peter IT. From the 10 to the 4 west, Peter IT. I don't mind, babe, whatever you fancy. Fine by me, as long as we talk about animals. I don't give a damn what you call me. As long as it ain't Sheila or something. <laughs> You're silly, Mr. Zoo. Why would I call you Sheila? Uh, I don't know, love. You tell me. Oh, God. I'm... This is getting confusing. It says here your name is Mr. Zoo, and now you're saying your name is Pat Flanagan, and now you're saying it's Sheila? Yeah, doll, the name ain't Sheila. That's a Sheila's name. It's an Australian joke. <laughs> I don't speak Australian. I guess not, sweetheart. Okay, well, moving on. You're Mr. Zoo. And I am. Cool. And I hear you've made quite a name for yourself. Why is that? Because I love animals. That's what I'm here to tell you about. That and myself, of course. Of course. So...